everyone, with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro later on. I'm Mike Emery. Glad you've joined us for an exciting evening ahead. Tonight, we bring you a matchup you're going to like. Eddie, your thoughts? These two teams both need the W here tonight. I can see him playing it safe early, but the question is, which team will make the first mistake? Germany's in possession as they move up the wing. Shoots one. Just missed the crossbar. Knocked off the puck. Trying to go to Iraq. Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. The Germans get a minor penalty for charging. Well, we love speed, we love contact, but in this particular situation, you must slow up a bit before you make contact. Perfectly on his stick in that pass from the left wing. Two guys together with force, big force. Well, there's no surprise there, Doc. We expected a physical game. The contest will be aggressive from start to finish. There's an early hit to set the tone. Moss is feeling the effects of that hit, Doc. Guys, bone jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. Moss is injured for sure. He went back to the dressing room very slowly. The trainer was helping him up the walkway. He's got some kind of head injury. Through the corner. Let's a shot go. Wonderful save. He gains the zone. Fires. Score! The goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release. The passer recognizes that he's got to get the puck up in the air, but he displays sweet hands as it goes just over the stick and lands flat on the ice. So he played a while in this period, and finally, a goal. I was hoping, Doc, that we were going to get that first one. Czech Republic's got that puck off the tie -out. The Czechs up the wing are moving the puck. Deflected off the blocker. That's the way to make him pay. Gains the blue line. Fires. Score! And the game is even. Nobles gave the goaltender no time to react with that quick snapshot. Oh, Edzo, we loved scoring up there, didn't we? Right up underneath the bar, you beat the goalie over the glove hand. He's not so confident anymore. And that's a face-off win. He's in on an onside play. Let's it go. Block it away. Gets that one on a cross. Off a of body. He scores! That's a strong, quick answer. Uh, he worked himself into a good scoring area and let it go on the backhand. I think he believes he's got the whole net covered, Eddie, but he's left open the low stick side, beaten pretty cleanly. The Czechs have broken the tie. Perhaps they can build on this lead here in the first period. And the face-offs won. First period is finished. Both teams scored. But there is a lead to carry into the locker room. Hockey's narrowest lead is what we have here. One goal. Hey fans, don't forget our 50-50 draws coming up in the middle of the third period. Get your tickets now. That punch the Czech Republic's one-goal lead came on this play. We want to show it to you one more time as we go to break. Shooting place. Score! A pair of goals by the same team. Juris worked extremely hard to get two chances. He scored on the second one. 
It was a wide open net, Edzo, when he went to shoot it, but what a great effort by the goaltender as he tried to dive back on the play. Just can't get there. The Czechs have built a two goal lead now. Perhaps on this faceoff, they can make it three before the end of the second period, at least. Neutralized faceoff win. The Czech Republic's trying to get it going along the boards. Shoots, got it all. Oh, that puck just hit his glove. The Germans need to acknowledge their goaltender after one of the better saves you will ever see. Somebody get this guy a stake. Terrific interception. The Czechs luck that along up the wing. Shoots. Great stick save. One into another. Another hit. We better sharpen up our pencils, Doc. Germany's getting a minor penalty. It's two minutes for boarding. These are the type of plays, Doc, that we want to eliminate from the game where the attacking player has no chance to protect himself when getting hit from behind. The Czechs' power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Team Germany penalty to number High eight, up two, there and a good two, reach two, and possession. Two minutes for boarding. The Germans up the wing, lock the puck. Waffle boarding. That's a good hit off the forecheck. Oh, and they've got a two-on-one here. And the goalie to the bench. The extra man's on. Germany's got a minor penalty. It's two minutes for interference. You got to be in control. You just can't run around and hit everybody, especially when they don't have a puck. Quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Terrific determination by Erek. Shooting! Goalie reaches the bench. Extra man out. Trying to go to Nakas. Perfect passing right through center. Penalty call coming. Watch for his signal here. The Germans have been handed a minor penalty for tripping. Now this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Let's it go. The Czech Republic's moving the puck in the defensive zone. Two on one opportunity. He scores just before the period ends. On a man advantage, you can't try to be too cute. Once the lane opens up, you must attack, and that's exactly what happened there. I don't know what he's going to do with that one, Edzo. That thing is delivered to perfection. Two periods have been played. They've worked pretty hard at it, and they get a well-deserved rest. Third period coming up shortly. Are you looking for information on the stars of tomorrow today? Check out page 21 of the program or our website for profiles on farm team members. The Germans are suffering on the goaltender. For him, there are great days, there are average days, and then there's today. More in a moment. to Reimer. Gains the zone. A shot. Outstanding off. Score! Another step in the road back. They're down by two. You want to score goals, especially off of rebounds? Go to this area. Oh, the goaltender's got to do a better job of that one, Edzo. He makes that first stop, but he leaves the rebound too close to the net where the goal scorer can grab it. The Germans have closed the gap to just two. And there is time here in the third period to get another one or maybe get two and get this game back even. The Germans look to make a difference up the wing. He could start some danger here. Pass cut. Play is stopped. There is a signal. We just wanted to see who it is he's taking off. 
Nakes gets his name on the penalty sheet, a tripping minor. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Got to ice it here. The Czechs control the play along the boards. The Czechs with a big penalty kill. Power play can be a momentum builder or it can sap the life out of your team. That was a great opportunity for them in a key point in the game to really help themselves out, and they whiffed on it. Nicely into the zone. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. All right, he's going to the bench. Roll the dice. Knocked it away with the stick. Loose puck, there was no getting through. Held there for a face-off coming up next. One last risky attempt to get back in this game. You pull the goalie, put an extra man out, and you should win the faceoff or you're in trouble. Held up against the boards. Czech Republic's on the move through the neutral zone. Net empty, score! One should put the icing on the cake. I'll probably put a bow on this one, Ed, so that'll be it. And they take that neutral zone face off. Nice stand up poke check there. What a strong wrist shot. Chuck that right away. And the horn is sounded, and this one goes down into the books. The game is over. A lopsided victory. I look at the shots and wonder if they didn't count the warm-up. No hesitation at all, and the thought process is what it should be. Shoot the puck. That's it for another great night at a hockey rink. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good evening, everyone.